As Terry here at D-Lab, I just finished another Dynaco PAS preamp. So what I do is I install these new power supply modules that have built-in AC switching. I also sell the boards by themselves so other people can install them. But I always seem to get the same question about the AC switching to the switched outlets on the back of the preamp. So in this video, we're going to show you how the stock PAS is configured and then how it operates with the D-Lab PAS Plus. So we'll start with a stock Dynaco PAS preamp and I'll post a diagram so you can see how the AC power was distributed in this unit before modification. Number one, there was no fuse protection. So if you imagine you had a power event of some type and you smoked that power transformer, that baby's hard to get. The only source that I found right now is through Dynakit parts and it's around $85. Okay, The switched outlets were controlled directly from the power slider. So when you turned on the preamp it would activate those rear switched outlets. This switch is rated at 3 amps 125 volt AC. So you normally find that these switches have arced and failed due to excessive loads that they're trying to switch. Usually two power amps. So as with the stock configuration, the unswitched outlets are active as soon as you plug in the cord. That's what my dummy light is plugged into. Okay, But if I were to remove that over to the switched outlets, when I plug in the unit, the light does not come on. That's because the preamp is not turned on and the relay has not activated sending the high current to the switched outlets. That happens immediately when you flip the slide switch. Okay, You hear that little click? Not this one, but listen for the relay. That's the relay activating and turning on your external power amps, taking all the stress off of the front slide switch. Okay, I hope that clarifies the operation of the AC switching portion of the D-Lab PAS Plus module. So not only does it protect your power transformer and supply high current switching for your amplifiers, these caps replace the main can filter cap and the 12 volt DC caps for the DC that feeds the 12AX7 tubes. So if you're interested in one of these PAS Plus modules, I have them on hand. I also offer a service to install them directly into your preamp. You can find the information on dlabelectronics.com or send me an email and we'll get you taken care of.